Hi, this is Deborah, and tonight I want to talk about women. Ever since I was uh, a teenager, girls have not liked me. It was obvious, very obvious. Uh, they always want to pick fights with me. Um, so I never really got close to any any girls. Maybe maybe one. She's been my lifetime girlfriend. Um, but now that I'm 60 years old, I realize that the women in my past who've had difficulty with me or who criticized me um, gave me a hard time. It's because they're not happy with their self. And uh, not to sound vain or anything, but I think they're jealous. They have to be because a confident woman is not going to cut down another girl. A confident person is not going to take the effort. Why bother? You know, uh, I, I, I think women can be very, very cruel. Much more cruel uh, than they need to be. And that is the number one problem, I think, with women. Is that um, if they would accept all the women without ridicule and uh, I think this would be a happier planet um, but yeah I've always had this problem and um, it's very difficult um, I don't look like other women my age I don't act like other women my age and they just have a very difficult time with me I refuse to conform to this new society where they want you to have, um, um, you know, be on Facebook or uh, I even just, I, I just put it on Facebook for just a minute that I was thinking about giving up my phone and I got so many backlashes like, oh, you can't live without a phone. Yes, I have lived without a phone. When I lived in Florida, I put my money into food and feeding my children. And if I wanted to use the phone, I walked up to the gas station and used um, the telephone booth. You know, who says you have to have a telephone? If I get into any trouble medically or whatever, I've got neighbors on each side. You know, one's a cop. Uh, you know, it's... it's uh, Society's put so much these stupid pressures on people, you know, just like people who go on vacation and watch TV. Why spend all that money when you can watch TV out of your own house? I, I'm just amazed at this 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 new social pressures. Yeah, I got I got my blog on YouTube. That's good enough for me, and if. If uh, if you have women or girlfriends or um, anybody in your life that's cutting you down and criticizing you, you need to just cut the ties, block them, whatever you have to do. No one should be bringing down your spirit ever. I think the only one who has that right is your mother. Your mother is the only one I think has that kind of constructive criticism. Um, you know, a real good friend has that right. But I don't think anybody else. You know, you need to find people who watch your back. People who are criticizing you and cutting you down are not watching your back. Those are not friends. No, they're not friends.